One of the jobs that I absolutely hate is cleaning the floors. I really don't like getting down on my hands and knees, but this is fantastic. This is a flash power mop. We've had these before, and what I find is that if you put too much pressure on them, the handle breaks, so you've got to be quite gentle. That's why we've had to buy another one, but it's a great opportunity to show you what it's like, and we're not being endorsed for this. We paid for this ourselves. Okay, I'm going to start by opening the box and it says open here, so we'll do that. So you've got to build it first of all, so we'll take it out, okay, so this is the actual mop bit, like this. And you have to attach the holder in here, and then there is a liquid which uh, comes in a container, and it's like a spray, sort of like a cleaning spray. Now this is the bit that broke before, and um, it's got quite a sort of, like, uh, it's quite flimsy, I would say, uh, connection here. And I think what you're supposed to do is press that in. So it holds it in yeah, place. Yeah, that's it. So that's holding it in place. So that's your handle. Then we have main unit again. Oh, it's the same sort of situation here. There's like a little button, so you can push that. And I guess it's just for packaging reasons that it's done like this, so as it fits in that little box. The next thing is that we have this little bottle, and it's a refill. You can buy these, and you don't take the top off or anything because it pops into here oh dear this looks as though it's broken here oh no it's cardboard <laughs> that's why it didn't fit more packaging of course it was easier before with the other ones we had ah that's it right so that's now in place uh, it does require batteries so where do the batteries go the batteries go in here. Oh, okay. Now, did it come with batteries? If not, I bought some today. So I think it's a cheap if it doesn't come with. It does. Ah. These are the pads which go on the actual mop. So we have been using them for some time, right? A few years. It used to be called something else. This is a flash power mop Swiffer. Yeah. That's what it was. The first one that we got, did we bring it over from the US? I think we got it from one of the US drugstores. Yeah, and then brought it back. Yeah, because they didn't sell it at that point. But this one came from Sainsbury's. It was £30. £30? Isn't that a lot? Yeah, but um, I mean, when you buy the pads, the, the refill pads are about Fifteen? Seven, oh. seven or eight pounds for a box of ten. I don't know, the liquid is at five pounds for a litre or at something? At least. Okay, now. So this fits back in here, I guess, like this. Right. We now need to put on the pads. So it has come with a little packet of, I think, five in here. Now, if your floor is really dirty, like ours, you might need to use more than one. No, I oh, think that one's yeah. enough. Well, I use normally use one to get rid of all the ground and dirt, and then another one to give it a nice little sort of freshen up. And it just fits on like this. It's like velcro. a sort of yeah, it's like a little velcro. Uh, so it should just sit on like that. You see. It's the right way around, isn't it? Yeah. Or is it? Yeah, this is the... Yes. I have to say, I think it's slightly more flimsy than it was before, so you do need to be careful. Um, Don't apply too much pressure. With the pressure, yeah. Does it work now? So I fitted it, I did it the wrong way around. I fitted it properly, and now when I press this button up here, Paul, it should start squirting out the liquid. There it is. You see that? Yes. 
And then you just start gently going like this to clean. And it smells nice too. Yeah. And you can keep using more if you need it, but it doesn't actually need that much. And the good thing about it is it turns round um, 360 degrees, so you can sort of like move round corners. So I think you're going to have to jump into the bath now to actually get a proper look at it. I know you're not tired of our show right now, so please subscribe to It's Paul and Marcus on YouTube. So the good thing about it is it goes on an angle like 360 degrees like this and it's especially good for going around the toilet so you can go like this here spray more and go down the sides like this and round the corners round the angles the only thing it's not good for it won't work getting into like nooks and crannies like that. Obviously it won't fit. So you will still have to get down onto your hands and knees to do that. And the same with the little corners at the door and everything. But it does seem to like bringing the floor up quite well. And I said at the start that I would use two of these, but I don't think I need to use another one because it seems to have done a pretty good job. Now I must say that I'm not using as much pressure on this as I did in the previous ones and that's where it broke around here because I was like putting so much pressure that maybe this came out and as you saw at the start the wire is quite thin. Okay well I think we have to see how much dirt it's actually collected. Oh gosh. Oh, God. Look at that. But the good thing is of course you just peel it off like that, chuck that away in the bin and look this is all nice and clean still and it's all ready for the next time. So it's a flash power mop, I like to still call it a Swiffer. <laughs>